Hi, I'm happy to meet you again with online lessons. Today, let's have a quick quiz before we start a new lesson. This quiz is based on general knowledge. There are total 10 questions. When you finish the question number 10, you will find the correct answer on the next slide. Do not read the answer first. If you don't know the answer, you can make a guess. If you score more than a 5, it means your GK is good. But if you score less than a 5, it means you don't read much news. Are you ready for the quiz? Let's start our quiz. Question number one. Which currency has the most value? A. Thai baht. B. Euro. C. Dollar. American dollar. D. Chinese yuan. Question number two. Who is the richest? A. Teacher Sarah B. Bill Gates C. Donald Trump D. Jack Ma Question number 3 Which is the poorest country in the world? A. Cambodia B. Nigeria C. Congo D. Qatar Question number 4 Which is the richest country in the world? A. The United States B. Brunei C. Canada D. Qatar Okay, question number 5 Which country is the largest exporter of rice in the world? A. India B. Vietnam C. Pakistan D. Thailand Question number 6. Which country produces the most food waste in the world? A. The United States B. UK C. France D. Germany Question number 7. Which country produces the most garbage? A. India B. Kuwait C. Pakistan D. Thailand Question number 8 Which country produces the least garbage? A. Singapore B. Japan C. Switzerland D. Armenia Question number 9 How many phones are thrown away each year? A. 3 million B. 8 million C. 5 million D. 1 million Question number 9 how many phones are thrown away each year? A. 3 million B. 8 million C. 5 million D. 1 million Question number 10 The last question 
which country is the best in waste management a germany b south korea c japan d denmark okay let's check your answer question number one the correct answer is euro question number two the correct answer is bill gate he is the richest person three the correct answer is congo four the correct answer is Qatar. five the correct answer is india six the correct answer is united states seven the correct answer is kuwait eight the correct answer is armenia nine the correct answer is five million actually more than five millions ten the correct answer is germany unit six spend less and live better how many toys do you have at home i guess many what do you do with your toys when they are old or broken i think you give them to someone or maybe you throw them away who collects all the things that we throw away the green garbage truck takes them away where does the green garbage truck dump them in the landfills what is a landfill landfills are location where disposable materials are sent they can cause land pollution are we destroying our planet earth yes too much here is some advice for a more frugal lifestyle done versus do one don't buy more than you need two don't buy things because of peer pressure three don't waste food because 815 million people experience chronic hunger each day four don't buy poor quality items because they break easily and create more rubbish the things you should do one do buy the things which are necessary two do energy saving such as switch off the lights when you are not using three do money saving don't spend all your money just put aside some in your saving for the future four do wait until your phone no longer works or your clothes are worn out before you replace them unit six exercise b1 listen and read spend less live better how many things do you have in your house a hundred a thousand a million too many to count i bet do you need so many in the past our grandparents didn't own as much as we do now and when something broke it was mended nowadays most people buy new things when something breaks and throw the old item away what do you think happens to all the things that we throw away we're dumping more and more waste on our poor planet here's some advice for a more frugal lifestyle that will benefit everyone and help our planet as well don't buy more than you need 
Many shops sell three for the price of two. This may seem like a good deal, but you only wanted one. You've now spent twice as much. Don't buy things because of peer pressure or because everyone else has them, especially if they're expensive. It may seem cool to have the same things as all your friends, but really you're just following other people's ideas. Be your own person and make your own choices. Don't waste food. Perhaps if we throw away less food, there'll be more for other people in the world. As much as half of all the food produced in the world ends up as waste every year. Don't buy poor quality items because they break more quickly. We have too much rubbish in the world already, so buy good quality products that will last longer. Do use energy-saving light bulbs and switch off the lights when you aren't in the room. When you're not using your computer or television, turn them off. They continue to use electricity in standby or sleep mode. Do set up a shop at your school to recycle unwanted items that you no longer use. You may make some money. Remember, one person's rubbish is another person's treasure. Do wait until your phone no longer works or your clothes are worn out before you replace them. If you buy the latest gadget as soon as it comes out, you'll always pay the highest price. Over 5 million phones are thrown away each year and only a fraction of these are recycled. Get used to being a little more frugal. It means that you only buy what you really need. Remember, you'll be adding fewer items to the huge waste that we humans create each day. Every little thing you do helps to make this world a better place for us all. Unit 6. Exercise D1. Listen and write the word from the learning box. Every day our households produce a lot of rubbish. That's every house in your community, in every city and in every country in the world. The amount of rubbish created by humans today is a worldwide problem. East Asia is now the world's fastest growing area for producing waste. It's not simply the people who litter the streets but the rubble and debris from building sites, the waste produced from factories, and the food we throw away. So isn't it time to start thinking about just where all this rubbish goes? About the plastic blocking up our rivers and seas? About the electronic waste and broken toys being buried in our countryside? You have a think. Just how much rubbish do you think you'll produce this week? That's all for this lesson. Hope you enjoy online learning. Stay home and be safe. Bye. See you soon.